morning guys it's competition day that's just still asleep so i'm whispering <laughs> um but i have official practice at 10 50. so i'm gonna start doing my hair Good morning guys, it's officially competition day. Um, I have official practice at 10.50. So yeah, it's like 9.45 I think now. So I'm just gonna do my makeup. I'm competing at uh, 7.20 tonight. I don't think we're allowed to film official practice, um, but I guess I'll see, but I don't think we are. And then I think we're gonna go to DFO today as well. And just do some like shopping in between because we've got like Obviously, I don't need to be at the rink until like 6.30 tonight. I can't, I wish comps were in the morning. Like if I could compete right now, I would much rather do that than wait all day. I just get so stressed during the day because <laughs> you just have like way too much time to think about everything. That's why I'm like glad that we might go do some shopping. Um, but I know Andrea is competing. I think she just had her official practice actually. And she's competing at like 4.30ish or 20 past 4. So I'm gonna try and get back to the rink for then to watch her. Um, and then come home, get ready, and then I'll go back for my comp. But I already love competing here more than anywhere else I've competed because like everything's so like convenient because we're in like an actual hotel and it's a five minute walk from the rink. We have like a Woolies downstairs so we can just go buy like food and stuff. And yeah, so we can just go back and forth to the rink. We don't need to hire a car. When I was in Brisbane and Sydney, you always have to hire a car because you can't stay like a five minute walk from the rink. I am having fun. Also, Nash's like whole family is here, which is also really fun because it's kind of made it like a bit less stressful. It's like more pressure to skate well, but also less because it's like, well, now it kind of just feels like we're all just like on a holiday, so. <laughs> Anyway, I'm just deciding what I should do for my makeup because I'm I'm not sure if I'll take it off later and redo all of it. I feel like I probably should, but oh, also, sorry, just remembered. Um, we get like professional photos taken here by Reese Lavender. He did the photos at um, when I competed in Brisbane and Sydney, and he takes like the best photos. One person gets their their photos for free, like all of them. Um, so they, he did like the random drawer and I won all my photos. So I get to, <laughs> I don't have to pay for my like pro photos. I think it was like 70 bucks or something last time. But I get them for free. So I'm like really excited because they're really good photos. Like I think just because I had such a bad skate at the last comp, I like, <clears throat> I'm just really in my head about it. Oh yeah, I skated in the public session yesterday too. I didn't really get to talk about that. Um, because yeah, we landed at like 12.15. And then we came back and just like chilled out for a little bit. Um, I put on some makeup and stuff and then I just like checked to the rink website and they still do public sessions on the other rink whilst the comp's on. And I didn't realise it was like 2.15 and I was like, it finishes at 3.30. I was like, oh my God, I'll run. So I like walked to the rink and skated for like 45 minutes. The ice feels a lot like our rink at home, Coburn. It felt very like familiar. So I hope the other rink is, um, I would assume it's very similar. Stressed, but also looking forward to it. All right, anyway, I'm gonna finish this and then I'll probably see you at the rink. Um, I'm dying. I feel so like out of my depth. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was not amazing and not terrible. So I feel like that's great. So yeah, 
Okay, I'm back from official practice. We got our shirts. We like ordered shirts a few weeks ago. Got a medium, so hopefully it's like. Yeah, that should be good. Hold on, we're gonna try it on. Perfect. Cute. It just says like crystal challenge. Okay, oh, I also. I bought a dress. I never buy dresses, but we're near like an outlet shopping center. This was like 20 bucks. It's really cute. It's really hard to find dresses for me because I have like a really short torso and short legs. I forgot my water bottle for practice. It's really cool. Okay, I think I'm just gonna wear this. We're going to the DFO just to do shopping, but um, Nash and his family and stuff are already on their way there because I had practice. But I'm so excited to go shopping. <laughs> it's not as cold as I thought it was gonna be here to be honest. And their rink isn't freezing, which is so good. <laughs> yeah, because our rink, like, we, there's meant to be another competition next weekend. Um, but I didn't do it last year either because the year before it was just so cold. I was like, I actually just don't want to do it. <laughs> Be walking back to the hotel. Andrew's scared really good. Um, now I have to get ready. Maddie's vlog. <laughs> Maddie's nervous because she stacked it. That's right. Although I did. Yep.
Oh my god, I'm gonna fall down these stairs. Eat with your mouth, not your jacket. I hope you guys enjoyed the little competition vlog. It's actually Sunday now. I just never really ended this vlog properly. But yeah, I'm really happy with how the comp went. I just kind of assumed I came fourth, so I was really happy to come third. <laughs> but yeah, that fall in the warm-up, I really don't know how that happened. Um, I need to show you this bruise on my leg. is crazy. <laughs> um, so yeah, I had the best time. I definitely want to try and come back to Crystal. I'm still tossing up if I come to Nationals or not because it's here again. And I had so much fun. So I would love to come back. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I, I'm going to post the actual Melbourne like traveling vlog and everything next week. So you can look forward to that. I'll probably put a little condensed down version of the competition into the vlog anyway. But um, yeah, I hope you enjoy. And I will see you next week for the Melbourne vlog.